Hey guys, welcome back to another video on this weird and wonderful AI channel. In this video, I want to take you through the live portrait, which is something new that has been released earlier this week and how you use it within Comfy UI. The original repository is this one here, which is uh, the live portrait efficient portrait animation with stitching and retargeting control. Essentially, it allows you to use a source video clip like this take an image and apply the facial movements of that source video clip to your image resulting in an animated video clip. The original repository can be installed on its own if you want to run a standalone copy of that and the instructions are here via this link which I'll add it in the description of the video. But if you are using Comfy UI and you're comfortable there, which in my case I am, I am going to install this Comfy UI node for live portrait by Kijai. So don't, this guy has been around for a while and has released many Comfy UI nodes in the past. So I trust his work and that's why I have installed this particular one. In the repository, there is a workflow in the examples directory. So you can download that, which is what I'm using here. And the way this works, of course, when you import this workflow, if you see a bunch of red boxes, you need to go into your Comfy UI manager and go to install missing custom nodes and you'll see those nodes will show up here click install and then those nodes will be installed the important thing to do after that is you make sure you restart comfy ui itself and also you hit refresh on your browser so your browser reloads after comfy ui has started here what we see is the default workflow this is the model loader here and by default, it selects FP16. There is also FP32 available. Start with FP16. Um, the live portrait process node will be set to CPU by default. So change that to CUDA if you have a NVIDIA or a powerful GPU that can handle that. Uh, in my case, yes, I do. So I will use CUDA instead. I'll leave all the settings as is. And I will load my source image that I want to animate here the video clip that I want to use here and let's just for the purpose of this video demo we'll choose this one here and these source video clips are also available through this assets folder on this comfy UI git uh, link so once you've got those there load them up and simply queue it up and away we go um, you'll see that work through and do its thing and it's actually very very quick I am not going to speed this up, I am just going to talk through it because it doesn't take very long to animate um, and create the final resulting video. Now in my case I added this additional node because I want to save the original produced output not this concatenated one. Of course this is good to show and compare um, the results of the source and the resulting output. But if you want to share on your social media just a cool little clip with keep everyone in the suspense, then definitely save that video file as is and uh, upload it to your favorite social media platform. So there you go. That's it. It's done. And we have the resulting video. This is the concatenated one where we see the original source and the resulting video. And here, this one here is the one that is just the output. So both of these are saved with the live portrait name and you can find that in your comfy ui outputs directory so hope you like this video guys thanks again for watching this if you like this video give it a thumbs up and uh, if you've got any questions uh, leave them down in the comments below